That's, yeah, that, that, that's <laughs> yeah, we have a lot to work with. There some really good things and some things that probably will be easy to improve. <clears throat> uh, remember that you were talking about projection, and last week I, we got you to project, and now you're not projecting because you're thinking about the content. Okay, so if it helps, for now, you can, you can read. Okay, um, but I want you to try your entrance first, and I will hand you the paper when it's time for you to talk. Because I want your entrance to be more... I want you to think um, that, that you have a skirt and blouse on and heels. I want you to think that you're more formal, okay? okay. Present yourself in a more formal manner. Okay. Hi, everyone. Hi. 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 Today, I, was to, I want to talk about my pain in learning English. Okay, what's a pain? Pain. 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 Indians have a hard time with some of the long vowels combination. Pain. 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 Very good. How about my pain with? My pain with, uh, uh, I want to talk about my pain in learning English. 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 Better. You're, ta you're talking really fast and pretty soft. Okay. Tonight, I want to talk to you about my pain in learning English. Tonight, I want to talk about my pain in learning English. Class, isn't that yeah. amazing? Yes. Yeah. And does that seem stilted and odd to you? It's exactly what you said. When I'm thinking, I go... <laughs> <laughs> well, let's just not think then. No, I'm asking how that felt to you to do it so well in the classroom. When I am... Um, when you're doing it the right way? Right? Yes. I, think I feel more confident. Yes. That's true. And slower and more articulate, it's more commanding. Yes. Say that sentence again. Tonight. Tonight, I want to talk about my pain in learning English. Keep going. Oh, I'm a person who likes. I'm a person. I am a person. A poison? Person. <laughs> person. 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 Mm -hmm. Yeah. How the R should be like back person. Oh, Your tongue should like yes, yes. Person. 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 Better. Person. I am a person. I am a person. I am a person. I am a person. Louder. When do I we say a or when do we say er? Like what? Er, what's er? A person or a person. Oh, a uh, or a. Yeah. yeah. Um, in general, you say a uh, all the time. You say um, a if it's preceded, if the next word begins with a vowel. In this case, it's optional. And there's a lot of that, as you have discovered in class, right? Because just about the top time I say it's got to be this way, we all come up with a, an example that defies the rule. Welcome to the English language. Yeah. So you can say, I am a person, or I am a person. I am a person sounds a little stilted. I am a person. Nice about? I am a person who likes rules. I am a man. Do me a favor, since you're so good at rolling your R's, say, okay. rules. What? Rules. 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 I want you to roll your R bar. Rules. Rules. I am a person who likes rules. Rules. I don't know where, how you're doing that. <laughs> 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 because you roll your R's all the time and they're really good. Okay. But in this particular case, you're not doing it for some silly reason. Go ahead and roll. It. Rules. Yes. Rules. Yes. Rules. Use your Indian vernacular to make it more clear. Rules. These people can't roll their R's. They're Chinese. <laughs> It would be really good if you could practice. You're, she's asking, where do I place my tongue? Right against my upper teeth. See where it is? I'm not saying that you can. I'm asking you to look at it to see where it is. It's, it's flopping in between my um, 
Yeah. Yeah. It, it, it's going really fast against the microphone. Okay. But you have a... <laughs> stop, stop, stop. Because right now, you are saying R to be pronounced from the, like, you know, very top of... That's where a rolled R would be. A non-rolled R is back and down. So, here it is. Watch. Err. 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 Where are you doing the R? Yeah, you, front or yeah, back? Way in the back. Err. 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 Yeah. Rules. Rules. Run. Run. Yeah. So because you get to do it. How do I know where to use the back? And you can do whichever one you want because you're from <laughs> India. I don't think. <laughs> and so you it's have talent. As long as, no, as long as we can understand you, we can understand the rolled R and we can send the other one. But you weren't doing either. You were doing something weird. You were passing over it. <laughs> I am a person. I am a person. Who likes rules? Who likes rules? Good. So since you gave a little bit of a role, I understood what you said. Okay. Keep going. I am a math lo math lover. Yeah, now you're really slowing down because you realize you did you didn't say the TH before, it's not like Matt. I'm a math lover. Well who's Matt? Your husband or whatever? <laughs> <laughs> or she really likes those doormats that you put in front of your door. I am a math math lover. A lover? <laughs> lover? Lover? <laughs> lover? Lover. Lover. No R. No rolling. No. Lover. Lover. Yeah. I am a math lover. I am a math lover. Good. Go. In math. Men in math, math. I learn. So when you have a, you guys aren't getting this. When you have a problem spot and we fix it. Every time you come to that same problem spot, you've got to slow it down and do it slow. I know you're impatient, but your patience will pay off if you can exercise it. So every time you say the word E-X-P-E-R-I-E-N-C-E-D, until you can say it well, you have to slow, say it experienced. Okay, so in this case, <coughs> you're going to say, what's the word? No word. Math. 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 Until the T-H is completely unrecognizable. Good. Okay. In math, in math, I learned one plus. I learned. I learned. I, not I learned. I learned. I learned. I learned. I learned. Err. Err. Yeah, you're saying like kind of, oh, uh, like, like, uh, you Richard. hear it? Yeah, like Richard. Err. Err. Better. I learned mm. one plus one is two, and I did apply the same rules, rules to any math, algebra or geometry? Algebra? What's an algebra? Algebra? Nope. The syllable, the, 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 the emphasis is on al. Algebra. Algebra. There you go. Yeah. So algebra. Some of, some of sounding, like you're speaking a formal English or good English, is also where is the emphasis in the word. It's not algebra, it's algebra. 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 Everybody say algebra. Algebra. I've never learned syllables, so is there any place where I can... Right here. <laughs> <laughs> Next session, we're going to promote. <laughs> Go on. But. 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 Yeah. But. I would appreciate it if you would stop stopping your T's. You stop your T's a lot. I'd like you to articulate them. Okay. So, but. But. But, but when I learned, but... When I, I started learning English, I realized. I realized. I realized. I realized. I realized. I realized. Yes. I realized there is no such rule. Rule. Good. Mm -hmm. Actually. 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 So she's saying actually. She's leaving out a syllable. Remember, that's our bad. That's our Achilles heel. <coughs> actually. Actually. Yes. Actually, there is rule, rule for every word. There is a rule. There is a rule for every word and every sentence. Which is not true. But that's a, a, yeah. I, I know what you mean, but it's not good content. Keep okay. going. Yeah. Speak up. For example, T plus O is two. D plus O is do. 
But. But. She, but. 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 I want the T. But. 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 No, but. But. Throw the tea out of your mouth. But. 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 Yes. But. But. Uh, G and O is not goo. Is not goo. Is not. Every goo. time you see a T, I want to hear the T. <laughs> is not goo. It's ha, 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 go. Ha, ha, ha. It's go. Right. <laughs> Good. The language has almost one the million who? of the language. The language. The language. The language. The. 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 The language has almost one million of words. Well, one million what? Words. 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 One million of words? That's really bad grammar. <laughs> one million words. Okay, one million words. Yeah, you don't need an of in there. Okay, so you have some content issues going on. So there are really two really big things that would automatically change what you're doing. What do you think those two <coughs> things are? Pronunciation. Uh, but just a T. All your T's. Okay. What's another thing? The. The exactly, and, and that would make you sound more like formal English, okay. and not as much no, not as much Indian. Because some of what you do is really spectacular. Some of uh, some of you, you know, you're and and um and you do. Your voice starts to cave in when you're thinking, George, about what you're doing. So, uh, next time we meet, I would like to have this completely memorized. Okay? Nobody's allowed to. If you want to write a speech for a Toastmaster, that's fine. You can do whatever you want. But the next time we meet, I want to hear all these speeches again with the homework assignments that I've given you individually. Okay? All right, Michelle, come on. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm sorry? I'm trying to remember them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to remember them. Huh? Much better. Very good. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Hi. 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 Have you ever carried a 20 pounds backpack? Anybody? Yes. 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 You have. Have you ever carried a uh, two 20 pound backpack? Like one is in front of you and one is on your back? No. no. <coughs> Nobody. I have. As a software engineer, I always carry a backpack and put everything in it. It's very heavy and 20 pounds. And when... Uh, when I was... When I was pregnant with my... When I was pregnant with my younger son, Mark, 11 years ago, I was carrying two backpacks. One is on my back, the other one is in front of me. One day? Uh, one day, it, it snowed very heavily. I, so it's like, I mean, this. All As long. usual. <laughs> I'm going to talk. I'll okay, go ahead. So one day, it snowed very heavily. As usual, I carried my backpack and a big tummy. At that time, I went to downtown office every day for work. So I need to work like uh, around 20 minutes from my office to the Union Station. My, my son, Mark, has been in, uh, had been in my belly for almost seven months. So I, I was working very slowly and carefully because I didn't want to hurt my baby. And if I fell down, it's going to hurt him. So eventually, I went to the union station. I, I felt relieved. But then when I started working in the inside, I fell down suddenly. So I, with my backpack on my back, I couldn't stand up. So somebody else just uh, helped me get up. Then I, my face was, I mean, really terrible. Like I, my 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 teeth <coughs> fell off, and then my uh, like some blood here. And then they said, "Oh, are you okay?" I'm like, 